Yo guys, what's poppin'? Uh, so I got bad news, kind of. Well, for you guys, not me. I'm gonna start vlogging once a week because I just signed up to an MFT course, which is, uh, so when I become a personal trainer, I'm more qualified and I guess knowledgeable. Um, but I've got to do a hell of a lot more study while I'm still doing my cert for MPT, which I've still got to do a hell of a lot more study. I just, I really don't have time to do a daily vlog. Um, so this will be the last one for this week. But don't you worry guys, I'll still be getting you informed once a week. So don't unsubscribe all you big followers here. Uh, but anyway, today... I'm going to show you how long it takes to make a delicious meal. Mmm. Delicious meal. Starting from... Well, I haven't prepped it yet, but anyway. What's the time? You know, where's your phone? It is... One thirty-four. <laughs> nah, four thirty. So let's get it done. Let's check out. My mate Sam. Just an inside joke to you, Sam. Asparagus. And a big old bunch of broccoli. Broccoli. Not broccoli nose. Rock a lie. Cooking with Josh. coconut cooking oil it's really good it's got MCTs which is really good for you uh, and what's your medium medium chain media I can't talk again surprise medium chain triglycerides and it's got a high uh, cooking point oh, that looks like an alien. I was gonna say that <laughs> This has just made me a coffee with my favourite type of animal. A breakdancing alien. So you sizzle that on up in the coconut oil. Delicious. Then I just chop off these white parts of sand. <laughs> and pretty much cook them just like this. Chop up the broccoli. Chop up this big bad boy trunk off. We got some black pepper, Himalayan salt, ground cane pepper. Here's a full lemon. By the way, don't just get any type of coconut oil, it's gotta be cooking oil, because you can get both kinds and the other kind's not really, I'm pretty sure it's dangerous to cook with. You can't sue me, because I already warned you guys. <laughs> Do a little salt bay. Delish. Do a little... Oh, I'm going to bring you guys over here close. How's that? How's that for a little... Do a little cracked pepper bay. Ooh. And a bit of a ground cane pepper bay. Oh, that's a lot. Too much. <laughs> well, I normally cook on the chuck on the veggies until the chicken's cooked because that's just too much to go on at one stage, isn't it? So I'm gonna have a sip of my coffee. Mm. 
Now, we get the vegetables. Oh! Got the little... Little Hussami boy. Chuck them on in there. Sprinkle a little bit more oil on it. I change it up to the flaxseed oil for the veggies. Just to give it a little bit different taste. Don't use um, normal cooking oils there. Trans fats. Disgusting. You don't want all that up in here. That's not what you want. Alright, you, you give the veggies a bit of a swizzle around the, around the pan. Let them say good day to the new neighbours, the chicken breast. Good day, neighbours. Fancy seeing you in here. And then they're probably going to argue and fight with each other because the chicken may or may not have eaten the broccoli snad at one stage. Who knows, but now, funny how life always comes back around. And now they're chilling in a pan together. Soon to be in my tummy. Sorry, I didn't mean that to be offensive to all the vegans out there. It's only been 14 minutes. That's four. Teen. To cook an extremely healthy, high protein, high nutritionist meal. 14 minutes, people. And if you can't cook that because it's too hard or you don't have time, if you're going to get takeaway, It'd probably take you about 10 minutes to sit there and wait for your food. Sorry, you couldn't see me old face. Um, when you can just make this. And it's really good for you. Mm. And it's pretty inexpensive besides the asparagus. But if you don't want to have asparagus, you can have beans or... You can pretty much put anything in it. It all tastes the same shit. Um, anyway, I'm going to serve her up. And would you look at that. Deliciously prepared meals. And if you don't want to chop the chicken up, you can always get chicken strips. A little bit more expensive, I think. But then you just put, chuck them straight on the pan. So this, instead of being... What's the time? 4.48. 4.48, so that's... 17 minutes could take you 10 minutes because you won't have to chop anything but the veggies but I'm gonna eat this delicious little mm. and I'll see you guys at me run you know the usual oh yeah you're welcome turkey guess what guys today it's not driving with Josh it's passenger with Josh Oh yeah, I get to show you every morning and every afternoon, pretty much every time we leave the house, the view we get. It's pretty, pretty goddamn amazing. I gotta tell you a little bit of a story. Okay, here it is. No, that's a crappy view. It looks better down here. How beautiful is that? I always go through these little, um, <clears throat> oh, yeah, here's our view. Every time we leave the house, we get to look at that. Oh, this guy forgot his car today. Silly bugger, how did you do that? <laughs> oh my god, I'm at the highway and I forgot my fucking car. What am I gonna do? Better go home and get my car. You know, sometimes you walk out of the house and you forget your car keys or you forget your shoes or you forget your <laughs> dignity. Oh, that's rough. Well, somehow this guy forgot his car. Which is probably not as bad as shoes. At least he can walk somewhere without getting a syringe in his foot or a rock. It just might take it a little bit longer. Depending. It could be going to the corner store. It's definitely going to take him longer still, unless he's got a shortcut. Unless, he, unless the store's a five minute drive around a big U-turn and he can cut through a path. Maybe that's what he's doing. 
forgot his forgot his car, but he's going to the corner shop and he can carry the bag home. Or maybe he's just trying to get fit. Good on him, kudos. Kudos to that guy. Me and Marnie. We're matching. Didn't even realise. <laughs> couple goals, hashtag. Fit couple, hashtag. Moustache finger, hashtag. Oh, and we wear the same shoes. Fuck, oh, we're cute. This lady forgot her car too. <laughs> oh, this lady forgot her car. Fuck, what is with everybody these days? Maybe that's gonna be the new trend. <laughs> or maybe it's a prank. Yeah, <laughs> the new trend is walking. <laughs> everybody, oh, it's amazing. Look at what the world's turning to. It's not a Tesla anymore, it's a. It's your legs. A legs are legless, leg more or less, leg more or less, legs mm, using legs more often than driving. I had two days off, I think I physically needed the rest, it was mentally draining me. I was feeling just agitated and a bit annoyed at everything and I am working out every day as well as running every day as well as work as well as trying to create content do my PT stuff I know it's all excuses um, but yeah I did my first 5k in the last two days I'm averaging around 22 minutes uh, for five kilometers and that's give or take 10 seconds and uh, I'm very comfortable at running that, which is good because I know that I could probably run 10K at about a 44, 45 minute pace at the moment. Still got two more weeks of training after this week. Three more weeks of training after this week. And then on the third weekend is the run, which I think I could get it down to about 43, 10 kilometer run easily. But we'll see how we go, eh? week everybody uh, I'm gonna try transition all my day-to-day -day activities a lot better um, I'm always to get better with filming as I go along but I hope you like the sneak peeks of what's happening and we've got our little business chart set up I'm uh, very, very excited for everything to come. Had a meeting with a few people this week, which is pretty cool. I don't know why I keep brushing my hair. Millie! Millie! Millie, 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 Millie! Oh, that's better. Anyway, <laughs> uh, enjoy and I'll see you next Sunday. Hopefully it's better than this one. Peace!